This morning, a New Haven police officer charged in connection to the incident that left Randy Cox paralyzed is getting his job back. The Connecticut Department of Labor has decided to reverse Officer Oscar Diaz termination. In 2022, Diaz was driving the vehicle, transporting Randy Cox. He slammed on the brakes to avoid hitting a car. Cox was not properly secured in the van and he hit his head on a metal barrier. He's now paralyzed from the chest down. Five officers were charged for failing to intervene when it was clear that Cox was injured. Four of those officers were fired last year. A fifth chose to retire. New Haven Mayor Justin Elliker said that he disagrees with the state's latest ruling. This case is, um, is, is tragic in so many ways, but in particular for, for Randy. We've made a determination that we will effectively be uh, appealing that. We, we will um, uh, issue a motion to vacate, which will go to Superior Court, but it's a dis disappointing decision. Diaz's termination was reversed after the New Haven Police Union filed a grievance. The union is now pushing to get the other three officers their jobs back as well.